Hey guys, welcome. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Nisi, and you're watching Keeping It Simple with Nisi. In today's video, I do have a grocery haul. Finally, I'm able to get another grocery haul out to you guys. But first, let me just say welcome, welcome. Welcome to my new subscribers. Um, I appreciate you stopping by. I appreciate you subscribing to the channel. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And to my returning subscribers, thank you for always watching, giving a thumbs up, and comment in the section, uh, comment section below. I really appreciate that. So if you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, join the channel, give me a thumbs up, leave a comment, let's converse in the comment section. I love chit chatting. Um, yeah, go ahead and subscribe. I would love to have you here. So today I have a grocery haul for you guys. I hope you have an amazing day. Today is Friday. Um, I normally go to the grocery store on Saturdays, but I took today off so I can have a long weekend. And I thought I'd go ahead and get my grocery shopping out of the way. I picked up some things from Ingles this time. I did not shop at Food Lion this time, but I did shop at Ingles because it's a little bit closer. And so um, I'm going to turn the camera around and show you what I got. And we can get started with this grocery haul, okay? Okay, first thing I got back here is a watermelon. We got some Sara Lee honey wheat bread. I picked up some Kraft Singles. I picked up some of their chicken salad. This is a rotisserie chicken salad. This is going to be my dinner for today. I'm not cooking today, it's too hot. <laughs> so I'm going to eat this and um, some crackers, I believe. Back here we have some oatmeal cream pies. Right here I did pick up a pack of pork chop. Right here we have some deli fresh smoked ham. Then we got some turkey breast, mesquite smoked turkey breast. Right here we have some Corn dogs, four pack of corn dogs. I have two boxes of those. Right here we have some smoked turkey sausage. Vanilla pudding. Two packs of hot dogs, uh, gauntlet great dogs. I have two packs of the bun size. Right here we have some Ziploc bags, sandwich Ziploc bags. I got the box of 90. I got some Cool Whip. It was two for four dollars. So I picked up two of those. I use one and I freeze one. Back here we have some citrus green tea. Lemonade by Minute Maid. 2% milk. Some ranch dressing. Angus has their Duke's mayonnaise on sale for $2.98. Um, I guess because of the upcoming holiday. So if you're in the need of some mayonnaise or you would like to go and stock up, Ingles have these for $2.98. I got some bananas. I have here some two avocados. We have here some an orange pepper and a red bell pepper. I'm going to make a, um, a rice bowl. I'm going to cut these bell peppers up with some onions rice, broccoli, and chicken, and I'm going to um, add a little um, horse and sauce and top it off with some yum yum sauce. Here we have some, well, let me come back to that. Over here we have a box of vanilla wafers, a box of snack crackers, three cans of these seasoned butter beans. These are so good. These are so good. These are by Margaret Holmes. So I will fix these maybe later on in the week or something. I have some uh, Bar S bologna. I get my husband to cut that up. We'll freeze some and we'll put some in the fridge. We have some Garden Rotini. Folgers Decaf Singles. And some snack size uh, Hey guys, welcome. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Nisi, and you're watching Keeping It Simple with Nisi. Welcome. Welcome to my new subscribers. Um, 
I see I have some new followers here. Thank you so much for subscribing. I really do appreciate it. And to my returning subscribers, thank you. Thank you for always uh, returning and leaving comments. I really appreciate it. So in today's video, I do have a small haul for you guys from BitLots, Lowe's, and Amazon. Okay, so I'm just going to jump right into it. And also, I have a, um, a grocery haul video that I did on yesterday. Today is Saturday, so I did a grocery haul on Friday which is an off day for me. Um, I tried to pause the video, but I ended up stopping the video, so I didn't get a chance to come and end the video, so I will attach it to this one, okay? So the first thing I got here, uh, I'm trying to get my patio together out here, so I picked up a few things from BitLocks, Lowe's, and um, I got something from Amazon. So the first thing I got from BitLocks is I did pick up some um, plant food. It was $5.99. Now, most time I like to pick up, you can buy the plant food in the little box, measure it out into your, your water and whatever. But I like to buy the ones that's already pre-measured. Most time I buy the packs of uh, miracle Grow, but BitLots was out of them. And so I, most time I find those at Walmart. They're like a dollar and fifty cents. But I did pick this one up, one or two pumps in your flour for a small flour, one pump for a bigger flour. You get two or three pumps. You can do two or three pumps. So I like to do that, and then you know just water it as usual. So I picked that up, and it was five ninety nine at Bitlots. The next thing I got here from Bitlots, I need a <clears throat> I needed a cocoa liner, but they didn't have just the liner itself. So I ended up getting the whole basket, which works. It, it really worked out because I, I have another 12 inch basket that I'm going to use. I have two flowers hanging up in the back. I'm going to put in these cocoa liners. I think they'll look so much better. And this was $7.99. So I think it's super cute. And I think it looks so much better than the original pot that it that they come in. So I'm going to use this with my other little pot. And, <clears throat> but I needed another cocoa liner. I need a 12 inch cocoa liner. And so from Lowe's, I went to Lowe's and they were out of the 12 inch cocoa liners. So I ended up getting a 14 inch cocoa liner. And what I'm going to do is, for my other basket, I'm going to see if I can cut this down to size. Um, I may have to cut it on the side and kind of like fold it over, but I'm going to cut it down to size and make it do what it do. And I'm going to make it work because I didn't want to have to go out here and run from store to store trying to find another 12 inch cocoa liner. Okay. And also from Lowe's, I picked up some Energizer batteries for my, um, solar lights these are the rechargeable batteries used to i can find i can get these for about ten dollars now they're fourteen dollars so they 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 have gotten a little expensive but you get a four pack for fourteen dollars yeah i got you see my door is open so i'm just trying to listen out to if anybody's coming in and also from lowe's I needed some um, clear saucers for my flower pot. They didn't have any. I tell you, Lowe's was just out of everything. They didn't have any. So I went out to the garden center. And I found these little saucers here. They have these in black. And I saw the terracotta. So I picked up four of these. I have one on the front porch for a small, that I put a small pot in. And I, to be honest with you, I like these better. I think they're more decorative and they look so much better to me, but these were a dollar and 48 cents at Lowe's outside in the garden center. So that was from Lowe's, from Bit Locks. And another thing that I got, I got from Amazon. Now I did a cleaning video, <clears throat> excuse me. <clears throat> I did a cleaning video of my den I donated some furniture to Habitat for Humanity. And, um, and so I bought <clears throat> a new den set. <clears throat> With this den set, 
it didn't come with pillows. So I ordered some um, inserts for the um, sofa, some pillow inserts to feather down. Um, I got four of them, but I needed some pillow covers. And so I got some pillow covers from Amazon and the brand is Muli. These are um, the Chanel pillow covers from Amazon. And so we're going to pull these out and see what they look like. Now, I've ordered these before. I have some on my bed in a darker color. But these are the cream white color. And these are, the size is 18 by 18. So that's going to fit nicely on my pillows. So what I'm going to do, and what I like about these is, you have the zipper in the back, and they always come with this little golden heart. So I think that it's so super cute, easy to stuff, and these are, I think they are cream white, and I think it will go with my curtains. I'm looking at these curtains over here on my patio door, so I think they would match really, really nice on the sofa, because I wanted to brighten this um, my den space up. The sofa set we had before was like an army uh, green. And so, like I said, I donated it to Habitat for Humanity and just got a new one. And I'll show it to you. Uh, but yeah, we got this cream color pillow covers. So I think it's going to look nice. And I'm just trying to updo and refresh everything around the house. But we got that. And this is my 18 by 18. So these are going to be super cute. So I had to order a pack of two. And these were, I think they were $14 each. $14 for two, so I, I ordered two packs, okay? And like I, they come in this little blue box right here. So I have the other two over here in this box. And... So I have one more thing that I want to show you, and it is a umbrella stand to go outside. Now, I do have an umbrella stand out here. I bought it from the Dollar General some years back, and it's one of those that you have to fill it up with water. Well, the problem is, once I put the umbrella down in there, if, a, if it rain and, and wind come through, it would knock over the whole table it just not it, it just don't hold the umbrella like I like I want it to. And so I had to pick up another umbrella stand and I got it from Bitlock. So let me show you what it looked like. And that umbrella stand was $44. So if you're in the market for a new stand, check out your local Bitlocks. And that one, this one right here has a little design on the stand. And they had some that was kind of plain. Uh, um, I think this size right here is 18.9. And they had other sizes that were 19.3 19 inches, I guess, uh, diameter. But I got the 18.9. And so I hope this right here will work. Because what I like about it, it comes up. And it has a little thing on the side right there where I can tighten it up. So hopefully that will help, you know, if wind come through. Just like yesterday, we had a storm to come through, and it just blew everything over. It was just a mess. And so I hope this umbrella stand will work and keep the umbrella in place and also the table in place, okay? So that is my haul, y'all. So let me show you what this den looked like. And I also picked up some, um, from Bit Lots, I did pick up some toilet paper and um, three cases of water. I like to get that geyser spring water from Bit Lots. And you know, a lot of times Bit Lots will mark that geyser water down to three for $10. So I always go over there and pick it up. And I got, like I said, two things of toilet paper. And I picked up a few flowers from Lowe's. And, uh, but let me show you what the den looked like. This is what the set looks like. I got the recliner. 
the sofa, and the love seat. And so hopefully when I put the pillars on here, it'll look nice. But I'll do a separate video of me, of what it looked like, and show you guys what it looked like. I'm still looking for a, an area rug. This area rug, it works, but for some reason, I just want a new one. I really want a new one. This has the burnt orange. That's not my color. My color is like burgundy. So I, I don't know yet. I don't know yet. And so we'll see. But that's what it's looking like. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed the small haul that I got from Bitlocks, Lowe's, and Amazon. And I'm going to go outside and fool around on this back patio. See if I can get it, pull it together. I have a flower pot that I need to um, spray paint. For some reason, I spray paint this flower pot. I feel like every summer. <laughs> and when it rains, it chips away the paint. I don't know why it just doesn't hold. So what I'm going to do is go out here and scrape all this old paint off. And I think I'm just going to get a, um, a can of paint and paint it and see if that'll hold up. But that is my small haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And like I said, I will attach uh, my grocery haul on this um video right here you'll see it as well and that grocery haul i did at ingles i didn't shop at food line this time but i shopped at ingles so that is my haul y'all i hope you're having an amazing saturday it's pretty outside today just like it was yesterday before the storm came yes here in south carolina and it also held so yes that's everything i have today I'm going to go out here and get started. I don't know how long I'll be out here because it's hot and my patio is not covered. So that's another thing I'm working on. I'm hoping to get a pergola, maybe. I'm hoping to try and get me a pergola to cover this patio. But I don't want to make this video too long. So I'm going to go ahead and end it right here. I hope you um, have a great day. Get out. Do something good for yourself. And um, don't forget... Give this video a thumbs up. Give this video a thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. And if you're new here, go ahead and subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. I would love to have you stay a while, okay? So until the next time, get out and do something good for yourself. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.